Believe it or not, this creature is about to start a huge chain of events of newer, better creatures, and I think it can turn out so well that I'm breaking my one year streak of not making pre update videos for it. This is by far the biggest roller coaster I've been on for a while, which even led me to not uploading certain videos. But it was all worth it in the end. Let me show you why. It all started here. We're figuring out creature diets, creature size, movement types, creature animal bases, and even creatures themes and build types. The owners of Creature Scenario were trying to figure out exactly what the player base wanted, which is a huge step up because we've been having some creatures that not a lot of people liked. And from this we can see that a lot of people like omnivores and uh, surprise surprise, uh, tier 3, tier 4s and tier 5s are liked the most, the rest is just Nah, no, people don't like tiny creatures. And on top of that, people really like all-terrain and sky aquatics and semi-aquatics and, and terrestrials. Which is not surprising, people really want good grinding creatures. And you can even see the creature theme and the build type, what people like the most. It's absolutely absurd that we have this information right now to see what everyone really likes. And let's just say, some creatures in Creature Scenario aren't that. Because when those stats got announced, we uh, yeah, we, we got this thing which is nothing like people, there's not a singular statistic in any of this that people really, really wanted, they, they didn't want this. And this is where the roller coaster really comes in, because right after that, again, we got more updates, which we got this, and we got this. This is nothing like what we wanted, this is literally quite the opposite of what the entire community wanted, so... Over here, I was starting to question Creature Scenario a little bit. We got a lot of votings and we got uh, some results of wanting big creatures that are very good for grinding and we've been getting. These creatures aren't my cup of tea and many of the people that are playing the game really agreed. But this, this is where the change is starting to happen because we got another vote pool and uh, it's for colors. Now, why is this a big deal? Because we got something huge, a huge change into how it's being done in the Creature Scenario community right now. BAM! This thing got announced and oh my god, this thing looks so ugly on here. I didn't like it at first, I kind of did, I couldn't see the concept but it's all meant to go together. I didn't get what this was, what this was, I, it looks kind of odd but I did slightly like the design until I saw this. What in the what? Look at that! That looks so cool! That looks way better than anything we've ever had! That's a joke, we had some pretty cool creeps, but it looks so cool! But I, uh, I fell in love with it way, way more after seeing the animations, because this thing is definitely gonna change creature scenario forever. Here is some of the stats, um, these are probably not final, but it's coming out in a few hours anyways, and you guys probably want it. So, this thing has 385 damage, 10,000 health, which isn't, um, it doesn't sound that great until you realize it's a photocarnivore, which makes this damage way, way more, around 600 plus, which is insane, add some plushies and everything, you have over a thousand damage. What? In the world is going on like what look at these abilities plus 50% block bead block burn block injury all these block things bleed attack defensive bleed wing shredder which I don't know if it's gonna stay invisibility excuse you iron stomach life leech which lit which literally lets you steal people's health which is insane mud placer radiation and on top of this oh what in the world is that look at that that's 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 a that's a giant crab. That's a giant crab. Do you know how big that thing is? I would love to show you, but my Roblox is upgrading and I genuinely can't open the game. So, uh, um, uh, nothing there. My, my internet, it's, it's, it's so bad. I'm still on vacation. I'm so sorry. Look at the top view though. This thing is massive. It's huge. I, I don't think I've been excited for a creature. Like, actually super excited in a long time. Like, I like the menace. The menace was great. But I love big creatures. Look at that. Look at that. It's so cool. And we're getting another thing, by the way. Um, <laughs> yeah, I, I'm not going to go over this one yet. I will make a video on both of these tomorrow. I just wanted to make a quick video about the both of them. But oh my lord, look at that. That's that's just insane, isn't it? Now, you probably want to get this creature. Um, and we don't know a lot about it just yet. We know it's a Valentine's event creature. And if it's out already, I've got a video out right here. So watch that if it's out. If it's not, um, I'm sorry. Uh, tomorrow there will be a new video. So watch this video if it's out. If not, there's probably a different video. 
Anyways, I'll see you in the next one. Bye-bye, everyone.